Hey guys, Radio Garage back on the bench. Got a Conex um, 4300 HP on the bench. Sent in um, minor problems. Um, wants to talk back fixed. Um, said it had no talk back um, on the note here. Um, and do do do. Um, show um, he wants me to show it on the spectrum analyzer and I think that's pretty much it because this was already uh, worked on by a reputable shop so it should be good to go um, which I did do an initial check here um, he wants to see a video so that's why I threw the video on but um, uh, talkback is working so I just want to show you that um, before I get going here one, two, three, four, five. You can hear it there. And turn it off. One, two, three, four, five. On. One, two, three, four, five. So I think um, what I'm going to do is I'll just make it louder. Um, I'll modify it so the talkback is, is a little bit louder and clearer for you. Because um, I think you did say the last shop uh, removed a part in the uh, circuit there so I'll get that back um, in uh, in shape for you there and then you want me to show it on the spectrum analyzer so um, uh, we'll take it to uh, 5 megahertz let me center this up Okay. So yeah, a couple bumps there. Um, you could see. We'll take it out farther. Take it out to 15. And yeah, there's. Oops. Thing there. I moved my center frequency instead of moving the span. Now we're going to move the span to 15. Alright. That looks better. So yeah, I've got a bunch of bumps down there. Um, nothing really too alarming. It is actually below 0 dB. Um, what's that about? Yeah, between about negative 5 and negative 10 dB down. So that actually wouldn't even show up on a lot of people's spectrum analyzer because they have it set at 0 for the reference. So you know, we're getting kind of picky. Um, take it out to 30. Yeah, everything's, well, we got one over there to the left that's just creeping above the zero line, but again, everything's below zero, so it's actually not as bad as it looks because uh, reference, yeah, where's, yeah, 40, 40 dB um, is our uh, carrier. So, ideally, yeah, we'd like to get a little bit of that gone out of there. Um, we wouldn't, we'd like at least 43 dB um, difference between the, uh, the harmonics there and our uh, reference carrier. Now let's just take it out to show the second harmonic. And, yeah, that's where you start seeing a lot of that ugliness. Um, I don't like that second harmonic where that's at. That's above zero, and everything else there is kind of in the mud, but it's there. So I'll see if I can clean it up anymore. I'm not sure. Um, you know, this is an export radio, so some clean up better than others. Of course, it's never going to be as clean as a, a 40 channel uh, FCCCB, but we'll see what we can do. All right, we'll be back. All right, so I believe. Um, where I left off when I did the preliminary check, uh, turn that volume down, was at the uh, 60 meg span. So that's where I'm going to start is where I left off. So I think you're, uh, you're going to be happy with what you see here. So all the same settings. I just went through and I retuned it. And here's what we got. So everything is way below uh, zero, as you can see there and um, that that 
54 meg I wasn't able to touch that but um, I did get the other stuff down so there's the zero references right there if you can't make it out so we're good um, like I said if I if I switch this this bandwidth around um, actually let me show the uh, the span I'll show it at 30 yeah there we go 30 you can see them they're they're really flat um, those spurs I get myself centered up here again but yeah I mean that's they're very very minor bumps better than what they were um, definitely better than what they were and we'll just show it at 5 megahertz and um, as you can see they're there but they are lower um, like I said there you see your side bands there and then uh, them other ones them other harmonics are uh, negative 10 dB down so we are good so uh, I think that's just about it with this. Alright, I'm going to show you a uh, frequency check here, channel 20. I got this going into the uh, the new uh, upgraded frequency counter here. Got the, uh, the Fluke Phillips 9 digit went with. Um, I'm actually going to be selling the, uh, the B&K. So uh, stay tuned for that video. That's going to be going up for sale. And I got it running on a, if you look at this here, that's lit up. That arrow external reference, that means it's on a um, uh, external uh, lock 10 megahertz reference. G, uh, GPSD, all my discipline oscillator, is going into that amplifier, um, which then goes into the frequency counter. So it is exactly locked on frequency don't have to worry about calibrating and recalibrating and all that other nonsense it's always calibrated so uh, let's check it out let's see what it's doing so we got 27.20475 so I'm going to touch that up a little bit and uh, I'll show you when I'm done with the, uh, the frequency alignment alright we're going to do the uh, final frequency check here, channel 20. There we go. Look at that. 27.20500, seven digits, um, zeros. So anything past that is just real gravy. Um, we'll go out one more digit. We just got to wait 10 seconds still because the gate time increases. So just bear with me. We'll see how close we can get. Bear with me here. Yep, 27205001. So, awesome. Awesome right on frequency, dead nuts. Um, yeah, uh, this is kind of a different radio with that... Uh, with that, uh, what is it, 2290 back there? So, I'm um, not a big fan of these radios, gonna be honest here. Uh, I'd rather just a, a straight driver and a final, or a driver and two finals. Um, so, I think, uh, I think them, them harmonics we saw was definitely caused from that, uh, the pill style transistor back there. Um, so, oh well, what are you gonna do, you know? an export um, they are what they are so all right I'm gonna button this one up and uh, we'll be back uh, I think this one's done so got your talk back all situated actually I'll let you hear uh, it's actually through the speaker now one 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 so all right appreciate it get on to that next radio that you sent me. Radio Garage, we're off the key.